And let the mare bless you with body, oh baby, oh. Star boy go bless you with money, oh my girl. And let the mare bless you with body, oh baby, oh. Star boy go bless you with money, oh my girl. Mm, yeah, sucka, 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 baby, sucka, 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 sucka. Oh, yeah, get from lockpa, 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 lockpa. Oh, yo, 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 get from baby, sucka, sucka, sucka. Oh, when I come through, they know we survive, so they turn up all eyes on me now. So many things we to do with your mama, yeah, baby. Ah, star boy getting plenty money. Yeah, you know what I got to do. Sucker, she love for me, show me how to do. Sucker, no doubt I'm the one for you. I'm the one for the TV every time you do. Sucker, he body like a rodeo. I'm a yak man, I'm a type of a low show. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sucker, 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 sucker. Sucka, sucka, baby Sucka, 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 sucka Oh, yeah, get from Lapa Lapa, Lapa, Lapa Oh, yeah, get from, baby Sucka, sucka, sucka Body, body Girl, you confuse my thinking With your body, body Girl, it's for you that I'm These are the Toyota 4Runner N280s The fifth generation Toyota 4Runners ever built by Toyota and their, re their, their year model ranges from 2010 through 2023. The fifth generation 4Runner was unveiled at the State Fair of Texas on September 24, 2009 and went on sale months later. It is built on the same platform as the J150 Series Land Cruiser, Prado slash Lexus GX and the FJ Cruiser. Despite being built in Japan, it was only produced in left-hand drive and it was not sold there or any other RHD markets. Initially, the, the 4Runner was available in three trim levels, two of which were available previously. The base SR5 trim as well as the top of the line limited trim are available as a two-wheel drive or a four-wheel drive. The trail edition is only available as a four-wheel drive. The SR5 and trail edition four-wheel drives receive a part-time four-wheel drive drive system, while the limited had a full-time four-wheel drive. All models came with the active traction control, the new edition offers Toyota's kinetic dynamic suspension system and crawl control which had previously only been available to premium Toyota vehicles as well as a rear, rear locking differential like the previous trail package. Moving on to their upgrades. In 2013, for the 2014 model year, the, the Forerunner received a facelift consisting of revised front and rear fascia with projector headlamps and clear lens LED tail lamps as well as other minor exterior cosmetic changes. The interior was also updated with soft touch door trim, leather wrapped steering wheel, and shift knob, revised dashboard, and center stack, and the inclusion of Toyota's Optitron instrument cluster as standard across all trim levels. Brake lines were upgraded for improved pedal feel and electronic trailer sway control programming included. No driveline changes were made, all 2014 model year 4Runner models are powered by a 4.0 liter V6 engine with intelligent variable valve timing that can develop 270 horsepower and 278 pound-feet of torque. It is made into a 5-speed automatic ECT transmission. In 2014, for the 2015 model year, the TRD Pro trim level was introduced into the United States with Toyota badging on the front as well as an off-road package as part of the TRD Pro series. The TRD Pro 4Runner included TRD Bilstein shocks with remote reservoirs, TRD tuned front springs, and TRD front skid plates. For each model year of the TRD Pro, beyond the two colors available on all trims, the TRD Pro is available in an exclusive color. This was Inferno Orange for the 2015 model year, Quicksand for 2016, Cement for 2017, Calvary Blue for 2018, Voodoo Blue for 2019, Army Green for 2020, Lunar Rock for 2021, Lime Rush for 2022, and Solar Octane for 2023. All United States models received the Intune touchscreen infotainment system with a 6.1 inch display and a, re and a rear backup camera as standard equipment with optional GPS navigation, Series XM satellite radio, HD radio, and Safety Connect. 
only the limited model featured a standard JBL Premium amplified audio system. In 2016, for the 2017 model year, the, the Forerunner Trail and Trail Premium were renamed to TRD Opro and TRD Opro Premium in the United States. These trim levels share the same mechanical functionality of the former Trail Edition, but add aesthetic differences and TRD backing to differentiate themselves from the base model. They do not share the same suspension as the TRD Pro model. In 2018, for the 2019 model year, Toyota began offering a nightshade packaging based on the limited trim, which blacks out badging, lower front and rear fascia, wheels, and portions of the interior. In 2019, for the 2020 model year, Toyota announced that all four runner trims will receive Toyota Safety Sense standard as well as two additional rear seat USB ports. The TRD Pro will have an updated grille design to accommodate the front radar sensor for the T. Double SP. All United States models received an updated Intune 3.0 infotainment system with larger, higher resolution touchscreen display, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto smartphone integration and Amazon Alexa integration, 4G LTE internet access powered by Verizon, Safety Connect and, sta and standard Sirius XM satellite radio and optional HD radio. The TRD Pro model received a JBL Premium Amplified Audio System as standard equipment. The system was previously only available on limited models where it remained standard equipment. Most models also featured a GPS, a GPS navigation. In 2021, for the 2022 model year, Toyota included a smart key system with push button as standard for all trims. The new TRD Sport trim was also added into the lineup. The TRD Sport received the same bumper, 20-inch wheels, and x rears suspension from the Limited. It also includes TRD parts such as the TRD shifter, TRD hood with scoop, TRD badges, and soft tech seating, seatings with TRD lettering. Unlike the Limited, it is only available with two-wheel drive or part-time four-wheel drive. Toyota added LED fog lights, low beams, and high beam headlights as standard for all trims for the first time. Blind spot monitor and rear cross traffic alert were added as standard for most trims. The TRD Pro now gets a standard multi-terrain monitor. Using strategically placed cameras, the system lets drivers check surroundings on the trail with ability to spot potential obstacles not easily seen from under the cabin. The limited trim adds a standard panoramic view monitor, which is similar to the multi-terrain monitor on the TRD Pro. The limited grade and TRD models also add a premium multi-information display. All trims receive rear occupancy alert as a, alerts as standard. Lime Rush is the new exclusive paint for the 2022 model year TRD Pro. In 2022, for this recent 2023 model year, the 40th anniversary special edition is a limited model for the North American market, producing 4,040 units with three exterior colors and standard four-wheel drive. Solar Octane paint is still exclusive to the 2023 model year TRD Pro. Now moving on to that power chain is that a 2.7 liter i4 was available on two-wheel drive models, but was discontinued after the 2010 model year. Plus, the 4.7 liter V8 from the previous generation was not carried over to this fifth generation 4Runner. Thereby, the 4.0 liter V6 gasoline engine adds dual double VTI, which improves horsepower, torque, and fuel economy, and comes standard in all models. And here's how these cars sound. Now here's my story. Back when I was 12 years old, it came to a surprise when I missed the annual news about the Forerunners in this generation. This was in the year 2015 when I thought the new facelift was started on the 2015 models when it was actually the 2014 models that started to receive the new faceship. Better yet, I saw these SUVs at the New York International Auto Show of 2015. A few years later, when I was a teenager in 2019, my interest in these forerunners had risen. It's not only because of their special changes in strength, it's also because of my height growth whereas being over 6 foot tall. In 2020, as I was also interested in the newest generation of the Toyota RAV4s, these are what I want to pick up first compared to those crossovers. Except for one condition, these SUVs aren't hybrids. In, 2020, in January 2021, I visited Bay Ridge Toyota in Brooklyn. At this dealership, I had a lucky privilege to ride the back, in the back of a 2021 Toyota 4Runner Limited in the rear seat with a friendly salesperson, Jody. It was not a great test because he only drove around the block. In fact, I would have driven, but I didn't have a learner's permit or a license until at least two months afterwards. On May, 20, on May 6, 2022, since I had my license at that time, 
I finally drove a 2021 Toyota 4Runner in this exact same trim and color. I drove it around three blocks with speed pressure. That's when I had a fun test. When driving it, this car feels like a vehicle made for governing Catholic priests. Speaking of priests, I have a priest, a sanctifying one, who is friends with my family, and he has a 2018 Toyota 4Runner in silver at the church's rectory since 2018. Seeing his car makes me imagine how he can use a religious power in his fight to battle with snow. And 2022 was another trending year for these 4Runners since 2020 because of the lime rush exterior color and the 40th anniversary schemes for 2023. These are what makes them my favorite popular 4Runners compared to the older generations since their facelifts were introduced in 2014. Towards the ending of 2022 and in the fourth quarter, I had seen these four runners in both Manhattan, it's Toyota of Manhattan and Plaza Toyota around New York City. These four fifth generation four runners do not come off road ready out of the gates. It comes to a fire road ready out of the gates. Odds are, if you are looking to prep the fifth generation for off road Mortal Kombat, you will need some work. The 5th generation 4Runner is still a 4Runner and is better than the 4th generation in countless ways, though it isn't totally fair for many enthusiasts. Introduced as a 2010 model year vehicle and refreshed for 2014, the truck looks just right for its intentions. Meaty and chunky in all the right ways, it certainly looks bigger and more substantial than the 4th generation. What the 5th generation does do drastically better is the forward visibility. The A pillars are quite a bit smaller and the seating position affords a much more commanding view of the road. Back to the comparison with his predecessor, the 4th generation 4Runners, the differences are vast. The 4th generation is simply more car-like. You sit stretched out versus upright on the 5th generation. Both have good space overall and make efficient use of the exterior dimensions that house them. Likewise, both have serious ergonomic quirks. Another generation of the 4Runners we can compare to, to these two are the 1st, 2nd, and 3rd generations. Those first three generations along with the fifth generations are made with rugged design versatility. On the other hand, the fourth generation was made sleek, which isn't enough for an off-road machine representation. Personally, the fifth generation forerunners have been my favorite forerunner since my childhood. When I got into the forerunner limited in 2021 and 2022, these SUVs were matching my preference for a high floor vehicle. However, the limited trim seems critical to me because of their ground clearance lower than the, than the other trims such as the SR5s. This was caused by their lower modified fenders, which also commemorates the LX series from Lexus that were built between 2016 and 2021. Those Though those LX series are obsolete along being the sister of the Toyota Land Cruisers. Thereby, if you want an SUV from Toyota for camping and trail ri riding, the community favorite is most likely the 4Runner. But a more upper option besides the Lexus is the Sequoia built with a Tundra platform. Going back to 2021, it was my first time in 14 years I went back to my native coast of Haiti. And there, I have been, seen some of these 4Runners in action that we never had when I was a toddler before coming to America in 2007. Good news is, a surprising fact and projection is coming for next year's 4Runner. For 2024, a 6th generation 4Runner is in the works to attract gearheads tired of its monotonous exterior design. Unfortunately, Toyota has not yet confirmed that United States will in fact get a 4Runner hybrid. This is what I wish should happen since the world is in, is in progress to make vehicles eco-friendly. Fleet production data indicated that Toyota will begin building the to 2024 4Runner in the early of August of 2023. As for the 5th generation 4Runners until 2023, we thank Toyota for keeping these SUVs in their same traditional rules as they were since 2010. So the rates for it is 10 out of 10. So thank you guys for watching, like, comment, share, subscribe, and give more support to these current 4Runners. Je vous l'en 
moi gagne un pile talent. Les dîmes que si je travaille, mon capoté un pile fruit. Les c'est fanatique numéro un. Les toujours à supporter. Même l'argent pour payer le studio. Des fois c'est lui qui connaît. C'est le bagage à Mandel. Pour danser, elle tendait. Moi connais la vraie mère, on dit que ça a tout cœur.
that is my woman. 